journeys are important because they broaden experience. It is always a thrill, of course, to share one's experience with others because each person's experience is unique. When I think of sharing my journey through writing, I think of my memories, of my own past. I have always been drawn to writing nonfiction. There is wonderful artistic freedom in fiction and poetry, but there is nothing that writes or reads like the truth. I write a lot about my childhood. I have been accused of writing from a child's point of view more than I should, but I have never listened to that criticism. Experiences that seem insignificant in the grand scheme of life to some people seem like the most important to me. I write about the small moments, the moments that happen early on. I think the world would be a better place if we could remember how we understood it when we were a child. In Dante's Inferno, the opening line reads, In the middle of the journey of our life, I found myself astray in a dark wood where the straight road had been lost. Sharing our journey allows us to transcend those things which divide us through our common experiences. The journey of writing is important to me because it reminds me of how powerful and universal art is. It reminds me that my life story is being told by the great artist and it gives me a balance between reason, imagination, and faith. Journey to Heaven was written in memory of my grandmother who died in 2013. She was the kindest woman you could ever know and dementia stole her from us. For those who've lost a loved one to Alzheimer's or dementia, no, you're not alone. Despite the pain and loss I've experienced in my life, I agree with Dante. If we always see the road ahead of us, life isn't worth the trip. When it comes to our life experiences, maybe it's not the destination that matters. Maybe it's the journey. My writing journey has brought me so much satisfaction sharing ideas, uh, getting support. To encourage other writers and other people. To understand more about oneself. Whatever memory conceives my story, it is transformed many times before reaching its conclusion. Journeys are so important for us to broaden our horizons, to challenge ourselves to see different things. Finding out more about yourself than about others. My family was weird. We moved around a lot, living in motels, sleeping on cots, parents, four kids, and a dog named Fifi, in a 61 Beetle that didn't have AC. We traveled through much of the USA, but missed a lot along the way. I missed algebra and geometry too. They'd already covered it at my new school. If I fell out with a friend, no big deal, we'd move again. Sneak out under cover of night, Dad owed money, so it was our plight to stay on the move, our situation dire. But when the beetle caught on fire, a motel maid took pity on us, gifting us a rusted bus. We joined a cult, accidentally, everybody's tabernacle and anomaly. Half a century of stories in my brain, I had to write them, else go insane. Thank you.
everyone, this is Elaine Carnegie with the Writer's Journey blog. I want to thank you, Tim Curry, for having us here on the Shadows Project Limited. And thanks for making this um, video for us to promote the Journeys Anthology. Journeys are important because they define who we are. 42 international authors tell their stories, share their journeys, and invite you to purchase this anthology whose proceeds will go to Doctors Without Borders. So you're also contributing to a worthy cause. Thank you. Thank you.